look at you, you make me blind Why do you have to be so beautiful all the time? I know I can't be with you It's killing me to see you with someone else What to do? Now I'm in the corner and watching you smile Watching you smile And I can't get over you I'm losing my mind All of the things that I wish I could tell you Every time when you pass and me by I fall in love There's something about you I wish you were mine channel. Um, today it's, uh, it's an early afternoon explore, just a little extra one for the week. I thought I'd come to this very old church. This was actually one of the first churches I'd ever done. And, um, impressive. Impressive, thank you. I felt so. Um, I used to do night explores. I didn't actually go into churches. I just used to do them on my own in and around the church graveyard in the middle of the night. And this was, as I said, one of the first ones that I'd ever visited, to be honest. And I visit a few times during the night when I first started the channel. Not sure if you've seen them videos yet, but if you do, just go back a year or so and you'll see them. Um, but it's certainly a beautiful place and it's actually called St Michael's. I do remember doing a day visit, a very quick one once before, and I had a fair bit picked up. So I thought, well, we'll have a little nosy through, since it's a nice quiet afternoon, and obviously because of the location of it, it's quite out of the way and secluded. You don't get many people coming here. So it's an ideal opportunity to obviously visit the location, not be disturbed. So I thought we'll come in, do a little bit of calling out, obviously. And we'll see if anything's here that wants to maybe come and talk to us this afternoon. I'll just give you a little look around so you can see the place. But certainly a pretty old church and very old indeed. I'm not sure how old this is to be exact, but I will find out and obviously let you know. These plaques on the wall, not sure what language they're in, I just don't know. But the one looks like someone was interred here in 1597. Over there. Over there. Over where, Spirit, please? Is there someone here with me now? 
I would appreciate maybe a name, maybe something that I can work with to communicate with you. As you can see on that sign there, well I hope you can. It's at Michael's Church in East Peckham. It's certainly a very pretty place. It's a little bit spartan compared to the last church I did in Cornwall last week, obviously. But it's very old. I'm not sure how old it is. Let's have a look on the... Chills Crawl. Chills Crawl. Well, that's a bit of an odd thing to say. You tell me someone's crawling around this place. It's 15th century, it looks like. But yeah, as I said, it's very Spartan. Not an awful lot going on here. But because of the age of it, you would imagine that there's maybe something here that still resides, that's residual. And maybe they can come forward and tell me a little bit, a little bit about themselves and maybe the location that we're in currently. I'd really appreciate that. It's a very old font. Very plain compared to some that I've seen. I think that's the general rule of this church. It is very plain. Not an awful lot to see, but it's very historic, so. And also the location. I wouldn't imagine it's had so much money spent on it over the centuries. I think it is as it was. Glen. Glen? Who's Glen, please, Spirit? Is there a Glen here with us currently? Could maybe Glen come forward and give me some sign of his presence? Maybe I could try an EMF meter. Let me get my EMF meter out. Okay, Spirit, I have a device there just on the front of that pew. Ginger. Ginger? I've had ginger before. I hope you're not referring to me as Ginger. I'm strawberry blonde, actually. But in any case, please um, come and move them lights on that box that I've just put up there next to the pew. I'd really appreciate that. Maybe can you take it up to the middle to the yellow light? Anything would help, Spirit. Please, come forward, don't be quiet on me, don't be bashful. Certainly a lot of old interments here. Let I'm with family. You're with family, are you? So you're telling me your family's here? Are they buried in this location with you? I'm just trying to see a date. No. February, I can't read that, it's Roman numerals. I have no idea. If only I could. That one's 1689. Here, Lyre deposited the precious remains of An Angles. What's that, Anglesey? Witten Hall, third wife, the thrice unfortunate Thomas Witten Hall of this parish of East Peckham in the country of Kent. And this one is 1654. Pleased it's pleased to meet you also, Spirit. Very nice of you to say that. Very nice indeed. It's pleased to, I'm pleased to meet you. I'm just wondering if you have a name that I could associate with you, please. It sounds very disrespectful. Don't trust the bad ones. Don't trust the bad ones. I never trust the bad ones, Spirit. And I do tend to pick a number of bad ones up. But it's very nice of you to warn me. Could you tell me who the bad ones are, please? Could you maybe give me a name? Give me something. Anything would do, Spirit. Let's have a look up here on the lectern. It's very old. 
nice little bit of height there. Looking out over the church. It's a very large place. Although, as I said before, it's very plain. I can't really say drab, although I suppose I could. Please, Spirit, whoever you are, come and give me some sign of your presence, please. I'd appreciate anything. Ask. Ask? I am asking you a question. Give me your name. Give me something, please, Spirit. Please, give me something. Anything. I might try and get a little bit of a drone shot in and just give you an overview of the location, just to show that how isolated it really is. But as I said, this is one of my favorite old churches and certainly the first ones that I did, or group of ones. So I spent a couple of hours in the graveyards of a night time. Okay, I'm going to put the camera down for a minute and we'll have a walk up towards the altar. And we'll see if anything wants to come and maybe communicate with us. So bear with me. Struggle. Sorry, welcome back. I've just put the camera down so I can walk up to the altar. You said struggle, spirit. Why did you struggle, please? Was life a struggle for you? Or maybe is death a struggle? Or you may be stuck here. That sounded like a low fighter plane. As I was saying, spirit, what was the struggle for you, please? Please, don't go quiet now. You have been communicating very well. You mentioned earlier on, don't trust the bad ones. You haven't told me who the bad ones are yet. Please, don't move away now. I mean great love to you. I mean great respect. Honest. Honest, I am honest. That's one thing I am, is honest. Please come forward if you would. I'm in this holy place. I'm here really just to talk to you. Although I visit these locations because they're so beautiful and they do bring a lot of peace. Amelia. Amelia, thank you. Amelia, are you here with me? I've had two names now. I've had Glenn and Amelia. Can I ask what one's here, please? Come and talk to me. Give me some sign that you're here, please. Move something. Tap something. Anything. Let's hope the microphones pick something up, because you never really know. It's definitely relatively quiet. We're getting the old few words through the spirit box, but nothing major. But as I said, it's just a a quick afternoon visit, just to while away an hour. Can I ask, this is um, after my south, this is called St Michael's. And my name's... Reflections Michael. deceive. Reflections deceive, that's a funny word, or two words. What do you mean by reflections deceive, please, Spirit? Where's the reflection? Is there a mirror in here, maybe? Please, give me more if you would. Could you maybe tap on that rear door? 
there appears to be a sealed chancel area. Could you maybe knock on it? I have regrets. Yes, I find a lot of spirits have regrets. It's very unfortunate and I'm sorry for that. But why do you have regrets? I would imagine you do in actual fact because you're still stuck here earthbound so you must have regrets about something. Otherwise you would have passed over into the light. Let's maybe tap on this door, see if anyone wants to knock back. Can I ask please, if I knock on this door, can you knock back? Could you copy that please? Could you copy that? Be lovely, wouldn't it, if someone knocked back? Please come and knock on that door. Come and do something for me, please. Show yourself. Okay, we've had a few minutes here, so... As I said, we don't want to spend too long here. Undoubtedly, somebody will come up from the village. But it's certainly been a pleasure coming back again, Spirit. It's been some time since I've been back here. And it's always nice to rekindle something that you've, or somewhere that you visited before. So I really appreciate Cabinet. that. Cabinet. I'm not sure whether, oh, I can see a cabinet, but I'm not gonna go into it, Spirit. And it'd be wrong of me to do that. So can I ask please, I'm going to leave you now and I really appreciate you taking the time to communicate with me. May I leave God's love with you and also leave my love with you. Please don't attach yourself to me or attempt to follow me home, I would really appreciate that. But be at peace, God bless to you. Okay, so Thank you for joining me for this quick explore of St Michael's in Paddock Wood. Um, it's been nice to come back. As I said, it's been uh, some time since I've been back here and I used to visit the graveyard of a night when I used to do my earlier, early explores. But I hope you've enjoyed this one. Look after yourself and I'll see you again on the next video. God bless to you. Bye-bye.